Hey guys, happy Sunday evening already. This is First Alert Meteorologist Daniel Sawicki. What a beautiful weekend it was. Temperatures in the 60s yesterday. Most of us were just around 60 yesterday. Some of us did get into the low 60s today. Most of us got into the mid 60s. This is still pretty well above average for this time of year. Normally we have highs around 54, 55 degrees depending on where you're at. But today, a lot warmer as we get that stronger wind out of the south today. Temperatures into the mid 60s and still at this hour, most of us into the low to mid 60s, 61 for Owatonna, 63 degrees as you go into Albert Lee, 67 right now for St. James as well as Fairmont. Just a beautiful weekend overall. Sunny yesterday, today mostly sunny. You can feel that wind out of the south and that wind out of the south is going to continue to increase over the next couple of days with really gust around 30 miles an hour again tomorrow as well as Tuesday and record high temperatures. Yes, those are going to be possible tomorrow. Most of us are going to be into the mid-70s. The record here in Mankato is 77 degrees. I'll show that here in a second. We're also going to be likely to break record high temperatures on Tuesday before reality starts to hit us again Tuesday night into Wednesday. We're going to have a cold front sweep through the area, and that is going to cool those temperatures down by Wednesday. This could also produce some showers and even a thunderstorm as we go Tuesday night into Wednesday. Right now, the Storm Prediction Center actually does have us under a marginal risk for one or two of these strong uh, storms to be uh, on the stronger side because we are going to have a warm front cross through southern Minnesota, and that's going to warm those temperatures up, followed by a cold front quickly. I know this time of year we're not really talking about severe storms. We'll have to watch the track of this low-pressure system and those fronts over the next 24 hours. And I know everybody's wondering about Halloween. It's going to be partly sunny, but it is going to be a lot chillier. Temperatures close to 50 for highs. Those temperatures overnight on Halloween night are going to drop into the 30s. And you can see Monday, Tuesday, well above average. Tomorrow, again, into the mid-70s. Tuesday, near 80. That cold front comes through. Tuesday night into Wednesday, going to drop those temperatures back into the 50s. And speaking of those record high temperatures tomorrow, the record here in Mankato, 77, set back in 1999. We're going to try to get up there tomorrow. We're going to have a high of 75. We are forecasting. If there's enough sun out there, might be able to get a little bit higher tomorrow. But as we go into Tuesday, it is becoming likely that we're going to break those record high temperatures by quite a lot, actually. It's 69, the record here in Mankato, set back in 2021. We're expected to get up to 80 degrees with that strong southerly flow as that warm front crosses the area before that cold front comes through Tuesday night. So get those bathing suits back out and open up those pools in late October because it's going to be summer-like weather tomorrow and Tuesday before it starts to cool down again on Wednesday. And again, I'm going to watch for some much-needed rain with that cold front. Right now, most of the rain looking like it's going to line up along east or I-35 and to the east. We're going to see where these uh, showers and storms really develop. We'll have a better idea of this as we get later into tonight and into tomorrow morning. I'll be on later tonight on KUIC News Now at 9 and 10. Hope to see you guys later. If not, have a good Sunday night.